For many of us, feeling overwhelmed, anxious or drained at various times, or by certain people or environments, is nothing new. Are you the person who always seems to attract people in need of assistance and finds yourself listening to their life story and being asked for advice even though you have no experience in their situation? It's possible you could be an empath. On this video, I am sharing with you the 5 steps that will give you the energy needed to support yourself and others. But before we start, let's check what makes an empath. An empath is someone who not only has empathy for others and their situations, but can also absorb the energy of places and the people around them. Empaths view helping others as almost a kind of calling, and they do find it genuinely gratifying. However, they must also find time to care for themselves, otherwise they are no use to anyone. Step number one, cleanse your energy. Next time you're standing under the shower head, cleanse your energy with this simple statement, please wash away what's not mine. Please wash away what no longer serves me. This will ensure you aren't holding on to stagnant energy that will eventually become draining for you. Step number two, be grounded. Grounding your energy helps to bring balance and allows you to stay authentic and safe while still retaining your empathy. Find a time to place your feet flat on the ground and imagine the soles of your feet rooting themselves into the earth. As you do this, say the words, feet connect to Mother Earth. You can do this wherever you are and as many times as you feel you need. Step number three, protect yourself. To prevent your energy from being zapped away by others, an intentional protection ritual is a must. Visualize yourself in a bubble of white light where you feel safe and protected, or try to imagine that you're inside a transparent gold pyramid. Do this every morning or whenever you feel the need. Step number four, define boundaries. It's hard sometimes to accept that you can't help everyone and feeling helpless can be a common struggle for empath. But you also need to have a life too and establishing some boundaries around who, when and how you help others can be a life changer. This can be tricky but it will be worth it. Step number five, honor your inner empath. It's in your nature, your heart and it will always be a part of who you are. Helping people is what you do best and finding healthy ways to do this will help keep you feeling fulfilled. Try volunteering or if you are considering a new job, look for roles in healthcare and education. Thanks for watching and I hope you've learned something from this video. Please don't forget to like, share and subscribe for more educational videos.